Hey, welcome to Ultimate Survival Tips. I'm David, coming to you from Command Central Studio B, where I'm locked away until further notice trying to get caught up on some gear and knife reviews. Well, today we're going to continue our series of looking at all the Gerber Bear Grylls Survival Series knives and tools by looking at the Gerber Bear Grylls Ultimate Survival Kit. Okay, let's get started. Bear Grylls Ultimate Survival Kit is designed to be an all-in-one, compact survival kit that you can throw in your pack, glove box, or emergency kit. According to Gerber, this kit contains 16 pieces, but to Gerber's credit, they didn't count every item as a separate piece like most other emergency kits. If we did this, we'd come up with about 30 items in this kit. Okay, so this kit comes with this rip-stop nylon outer bag, clear plastic zipper seal bag, the Gerber Clutch Mini Multi-Tool, the small LED light, a handsaw, this lanyard whistle, the Bear Girls Emergency Whistle, a signaling mirror, survival blanket, fire starter rod and striker, waterproof matches, a cotton ball for tinder, a length of snare wire, some white nylon cord, waxed thread, a fishing kit, sewing kit, and the Bear Girls Priorities of Survival pocket guide. Now let's zoom in and look at each item of this kit individually. First, the survival kit outer bag is made of what seems to be a good quality ripstop nylon with a zipper. All the gear in this kit fits comfortably in this pouch, which is only about 5 by 7 inches and about 2.5 inches wide when full. On the back, we have waterproof land to air rescue instructions sewn onto the bag. Now we have what appears to be a waterproof zipper, but for the most part, this zipper is just for show because when we fully close the zipper, we still have about an eighth of an inch opening at the end for water to seep in. Fortunately, Gerber's packed all the contents of this kit in a heavy duty, clear, and truly waterproof bag as a zip seal to keep water away from the gear. So the outer pouch is really more for looks and to protect the inner pouch. Attached to the zipper of the outer bag, we have about six inches of nylon cordage that's attached to the Bear Grylls emergency whistle. This whistle is simple, durable, loud, and it looks kind of cool. Now, inside the inner waterproof bag, we have the single LED light that's attached to a keychain. Now, in a pinch, without any light, I'd be pretty happy to have this one, as long as it worked. It uses a large replaceable watch type battery, and it turns on by pulling this keychain. But honestly, this light's really pretty junky. I have two of these kits, and the light in the other kit feels like I'm going to pull the thing apart every time I use it. Next we have this wire deal that's called a handsaw. It's basically about 12 inches of woven wire that has a coarse texture to it. At the ends we have these heavy duty spinner things that are attached to what look like key rings. Now I've seen these gadgets before and always wanted to try one. So I tested it on a small tree. At first it seemed to cut okay, but once I got a little way into the tree the thing bound up. So I'm not going to use this saw, at least not for cutting a tree. Well next, I'm not really sure what to say about this little red lanyard whistle. It seems pretty cheap and redundant considering we have the Bear Girls whistle attached to the zipper of the outer pouch. Next we have this signaling mirror. Although it's not the highest quality mirror, this little dude could come in handy if you ever need to signal for help. Now the kit comes with a very lightweight survival blanket that could come in handy in a pinch. When you're cold, survival blankets can reflect up to 90% of your body's heat back to you. But this survival blanket is really thin and I'm not sure how it's going to hold up. So be really careful when you use it. Bear Girls Ultimate Survival Kit comes with this hefty fire steel rod with a handle that's attached to the striker using about a foot of nylon cord. This fire steel works really well once you scrape some of the dark outer coating off. And make sure that you angle the striker with the edge against the fire steel when trying to start a fire. Next this kit comes with 10 very large waterproof matches and a striker board. Next we have a small cotton ball. Cotton balls make great tinder. Now there's just one cotton ball in this kit. I would have liked to see Gerber include a few more. But since cotton balls are cheap and you probably have some lying around your house, I'd recommend throwing two or three more in this kit with a dab of petroleum jelly on each cotton ball. This will help your cotton ball tinder burn longer as the petroleum jelly acts like fuel on a torch. Now we have about 12 inches of copper snare wire for trapping small game. And there's about 10 foot of pretty good quality white nylon cord will come in handy for a variety of things. And there's a small roll of wax thread for setting snares and traps. And we have this little fishing kit with fishing line, hooks, and sinkers. Then we have this handy sewing kit with four colors of thread and a couple of needles that will come in handy for stitching things up. And last but not least, we have the Gerber Clutch Mini Multi-Tool, which has needle nose pliers, a wire cutter, a fine edge knife, a small Phillips head screwdriver, 
a small flat screwdriver, a medium flat screwdriver with a bottle opener, and tweezers. And then we have this nail file which could double as a match striker in a pinch. This kit, like all the other Bear Girls gear, comes with the Bear Girls Priorities of Survival Pocket Guide, which may be the most useful piece of kit in this pack. Owner reviews of this kit are mixed and average around 3 out of 5 stars. Some love this kit and some just hate it. Owners comment on many of the things that we've covered in this review, including a few pieces of fairly cheap gear. Some recommend a way from purchasing this kit and suggest making your own. But many still seem pretty happy with the Ultimate Survival Kit and like its size. We rate the Bear Girls Ultimate Survival Kit at 3 out of 5 stars. Words do mean things and this kit is not quite the Ultimate Survival Kit, at least not yet. I do hope that Gerber upgrades this kit in the future with a few higher quality items and by adding a few things that seem to be obviously missing, like a basic first aid kit, a few water purification tablets, and a compass. Now the price of this kit has dropped to around $35 online in the US, so the price alone makes it a fairly attractive compact survival kit, especially if you don't want to fuss with putting together your own compact kit. If you want to take a look at some other compact survival kits in the Bear Grylls line, and you'd like a kit with a compass, some first aid items, and a quality pocket knife, check out my review of the Bear Grylls Scout Essentials kit. If you want a more basic version of this kit that loses most of the cheap gear, and is about half the weight, size, and price, and is overall a very nice value at less than $20 US, check out my review of the Bear Grylls Basic Survival Kit. If you'd like to step up to a more complete, pre-made, all-in-one survival kit, Essie makes a few professional grade kits that are field tested and used by survivalists around the world. See the video description for links. If you already have the Bear Girls Ultimate Survival Kit, or you want to grab this kit and beef it up with a few more of your own items, we recommend that you add a button compass, some water purification tablets, a few important first aid items, and a higher quality mini LED flashlight like the Bear Girls Micro Torch. Cool thing is, these additional items should still fit comfortably in this compact bag. So we've just taken a look at the Gerber Bear Grylls Ultimate Survival Kit. For your convenience, I've included links to all the gear that I've mentioned in the video description on YouTube. So don't forget to subscribe to this channel. And for more gear reviews, survival tips, and survival news, check out ultimatesurvivaltips.com. While you're there, grab our monthly survival e-mag, like us on Facebook, Follow us on Twitter to get the latest news and be the first to hear about the great gear giveaway contest that we have planned. Okay, this is David. I hope to see you on the other side and remember, be prepared because you never know.